short arms or if you've got limited flexibility. Um, so right now I have my carrier set up for a standard backpack straps. Um, the first thing that you can do if you really struggle with that chest clip um, is look to purchase a carrier that allows for cross straps in the back. Um, that would be something like the Ergo Baby Adapt, which is actually what I'm using today. Um, Beko Gemini, Beko Soleil, Cat Brew Baby Piccolo, um, any of those options that cross straps in the back um, will allow you to skip using that chest clip. Um, and so you can skip it that way. Okay, so if you have to do a chest clip, if you've got a carrier, um, like an older generation Ergo or a Tula uh, that does not cross in the back, what you can do is loosen your straps on the sides. I'm going to loosen them quite a bit. And the first thing you can do is make sure your chest clip is pre-buckled. So you can go ahead and buckle your chest clip before all this is before putting baby in. And then I can just go ahead and put my panel down. Go ahead and grab my baby from the soft surface. Bring baby up to my chest. Let baby sit right down into the carrier. And then from here, I'm gonna go ahead and get those straps. And I'm gonna go ahead and put one arm in this strap. My straps twisted themselves. So this might take a little practice to get used to. Okay. So I'm grabbing both my straps and putting them on. This chest clip down, I'm gonna duck into just like a t-shirt. And then while I'm still supporting baby with one hand, I'm gonna go to my back and pull the straps down. Again, same thing, go to my back, pull the straps down so that my chest clip gets nice and low on my back. And then while I'm still, again, I'm still supporting baby here, I'm gonna go ahead and tighten my straps now. A little bit at a time is generally the best because that will help that chest clip. Um, when you pull this way, the chest clip will get pulled down as you tighten your strap. And so if you pull one side all the way at a time, you might end up with an uneven strap. So I'm position my little demo down here. There we go. Okay, so that's one way, is to go ahead and just pre-buckle the strap. Uh, now to get baby out of here, I can do that same thing. So I'm gonna go ahead and loosen my buckles. This buckle's right here in front. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up on the end and it just loosens right up. Same thing over here. I'm going to go ahead and just loosen it. And I'm supporting baby so that baby's nice and secure and safe. And then what I can do is go ahead and pull up until I can duck out of the carrier and just pull my arms out at the same time. Take baby out, put them on a soft surface. All right, now this time I'm gonna go ahead and do that again without my chest clip buckled. So now it is unbuckled, but my straps here are still nice and loose. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up baby again. Picking up baby, bringing them right to sit on the top of the panel. Putting baby in the carrier, putting the straps on my shoulders. And now from here, what I'm gonna do is walk my hands up the straps of the carrier keeping tension on it so that it still is supporting baby. So I'm gonna go ahead, use this totally free hand to grab nice and tight. Let me see if I can get closer. There you go, grab nice and tight. I'm gonna grab the other strap on this side, walk my hands up and back all the way until I get to that chest clip. I'm still keeping tension on the carrier. Buckling the chest clip, listening for that good snap. Now I kept one hand up here keeping tension. My other hand has come back to support baby. And now I'm gonna go ahead, pull those straps forward again. Pull that chest clip right down my back. The lower you get that chest clip, the better. Uh, it's gonna be a counter pressure to the weight. So especially when you've got a bigger baby here than a nine pound demo doll, it's gonna make a big difference in fit and comfort. All right, and then I went back and forth again tightening that strap, and now I have a nice low chest clip, one that I cannot reach on my own. And then to get out of here, I can do the same thing. I can go ahead, support baby, pick up again on that buckle, picking up on the end, and just loosening it, getting that extra slack. Supporting baby with this hand, 
grabbing that buckle. Loosening. There we go. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead, grab the straps again, walk my hands up. Walk my hands up, 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 till I can grab that chest clip. Unbuckle. Go ahead and grab my straps again. Walk my hands back down. And go ahead and peel baby out of the carrier. There we go. Thanks, guys.